Vision Norfolk, Magpie News, Autumn 2023. Welcome to the Autumn edition of Magpie News, with updates from Vision Norfolk, your local sight loss charity. If you would like this newsletter in another format, please let us know by calling 01603-573-000 or emailing office at visionnorfolk.org. Dot UK. Magpie News is currently available by mail in printed, braille, or audio on memory stick or CD. A digital format is also available on our website and by email as a Word document or a PDF. Celebrating our volunteers. On Thursday, 8th June, around 30 volunteers joined staff members for our annual outing to celebrate the contributions made by our volunteers as part of National Volunteers Week. Attendees had the opportunity to enjoy coffee and pastries aboard a train pulled by a 1959 Black Prince steam locomotive. The trip was on the Poppy Line from Holt to Sheringham and included free time in Sheringham before the return journey. We would not be able to provide our services without the support of our dedicated volunteers who help to run activities, provide guiding, provide transportation, volunteer as telefriends, support fundraising activities, and provide support for our children, young people, and family service. If you or someone you know is interested in volunteering for Vision Norfolk, you can contact volunteers at visionnorfolk.org.uk or call your local hub. Details at the end of the newsletter. We need volunteers for all roles. But are particularly looking for drivers in the Fakenham, Emnith, and Norwich area. Activities volunteers for the Fakenham Coffee Morning, sighted guides for outings across the county, and volunteers to help with activities for children and families. In this edition, Vision Norfolk News, updates from your local sight loss charity, community hub updates, news from each of our community hubs in Norwich, Kings Lynn, and Great Yarmouth. Children, young people, and families. Learn about our service for local people ages 0 to 25 and their families. Equipment news. Updates about equipment and technology, including events and tips. Activities. List of activities and events coming up over the next few months across the county. Other things. Other opportunities, appeals for feedback, and equipment for sale. Contact details. Find out how to reach us with your questions. Community Outreach Workers. We are pleased to announce that we have launched our new Community Outreach Service, which aims to provide emotional and practical support to vision-impaired people in their local community. Our friendly team of Community Outreach Workers will provide a range of support services designed to help anyone experiencing sight loss to live a more independent lifestyle. The type of support on offer includes assistance and advice on welfare, benefit, and housing applications, information and advice on the latest assistive technology and equipment for your home, providing support to reduce loneliness and isolation, information and advice on specific eye conditions and helpful tips to make the best of remaining vision, support for families, friends, and carers, identifying additional support needs and signposting to other relevant services. To contact a member of our community outreach team, please call 016-03-573-000. Charity Christmas Cards. Our thanks goes out to everyone who participated in this year's Christmas art competition. We really enjoyed seeing all your lovely artwork. The winning designs will be printed on our 2023 Christmas cards that are sold to raise funds to support our services for local people. The cards will be available for purchase from October to December at the original Norwich Charity Christmas Card Shop at St. Peter Mancraft, across from the Forum in Norwich and at our community hubs in Norwich, Kings Lynn, and Great Yarmouth. With the wonderful response we've had to the competition, 
we hope to hold another art competition for designs to appear on our 2024 Christmas cards. More details coming soon. Winning designs. Image. Drawing of the green, blue, and orange northern lights behind the black outline of trees. Artist. Roy Meredith. Image. Stamped outline of a decorated Christmas tree with presents and a star on top. Colored in with felt tip pens in bright green, yellow, pink, orange, red, purple, and blue. Artist, Rhiannon, age 6. Other entries. Image, brown and red robin painted on white paper. It has a black beak and eye and legs drawn on with pen. Artist, Maggie Duffy. Image, a snowman and two evergreen trees painted on white paper. At the top of the image, Ho 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 is written in red paint. Artist, Kelsey Batch. Image, a Christmas tree with red and blue sparkly ornaments and a sparkly star on brown pattern paper. There's a sparkly red bow in the top left corner. Artist, Paige Simmons. Image, a penguin with an orange beak and feet drawn with marker on white paper. There are two snowflakes on the left and the word Christmas in red and green on the right. Artist, Evie. Norwich Hub Updates. What we've been up to. Over the spring and summer, our long distance walking group have been very active. Average distance covered per walk is about four miles. We have been very fortunate this year in that most of our walks have been educational as well. An early morning stroll through RSPP Nature Reserve, Lake and Heath, Fen, to listen to the bird song resulted in us hearing 53 different types of birds singing their hearts out. We know this because our guide from the British Trust for Ornithology listed them all for us. Thank you to the Brex Council for organising our visit. We also went to the Thetford Arbitorium at Linford at the invitation of the Forestry Commission. There we found out about the work they do, making sure there are healthy trees and forests across the country. A trip to Red Wings Horse and Donkey Sanctuary at Elsham gave our clients a chance to get up close and stroke various horses, donkeys and goats, some for the very first time. Coming up, we have a very busy autumn coming up at the Norwich Hub. On Thursday the 5th of October, back by popular demand, is Quiz and Chips. This time, to add a little bit of spice to proceedings, as if any extra were needed, it's an inter-hub competition. Teams of no more than four people. But don't worry if you don't have three vision-impaired friends. Teams will be made up on the day. On Friday the 13th of October, Richard Matthew from the Norwich Society will be coming along to the Norwich Hub to give a talk on the historic Dragon Hall. This will take place immediately after the Macula Society have had their monthly get-together. If you have macular degeneration, why not come along at 12 noon and join in with their meeting first? Richard Matthew will be there from 1pm. On Thursday the 2nd and 16th of November, Rebecca Amphlett from Dragon Mosaics will be making a very welcome return. Clients will be able to make a Christmas themed tesserae decoration. You must be able to make both dates to complete the decoration. All events listed must be booked in advance with Richard Polly on 01603 573 000 extension 322 or email richard.polly at visionnorfolk org.uk King's Lynn Hub Updates Tandem Cycling We are delighted to be working with the West Norfolk branch of Cycling UK to offer the opportunity for our clients to try tandem cycling. From short taster sessions to longer cycle rides, we have something to suit everyone. Our clients have told us they are enjoying the freedom of being back on a bicycle, the fresh air, lovely countryside, and the coffee stop along the way. Sound and Vision Choir The Vision Norfolk Choir, also known as Sound and Vision, 
are delighted to welcome their new tutor, Helen Havis. Helen started with the choir in July. She and the choir are working on a full list of songs to incorporate a range of musical tastes and styles. The choir is currently working on the song A Million Dreams from The Greatest Showman, Walking on Sunshine by Katrina and the Waves, and Let It Be by The Beatles. The fun and friendly sessions take place fortnightly on a Wednesday from 1 p.m. until 3 p.m. at the workshop in Kings Lynn, Stoddy Lodge. On Tuesday, 23rd May, a group from the Kings Lynn Hub took a trip out to enjoy the azaleas and water gardens in the beautiful grounds of Stoddy Lodge. The colorful and scented gardens were spectacular feasts for the senses, and along with the lovely sunshine and tasty homemade ice creams made it a memorable day. More members welcome. We are looking for more clients to get involved in the following activities. Knitting, shuffleboard, choir, tandem cycling, and sit fit in Downham Market. Great Yarmouth Hub updates. We have had a very busy few months both in and out of Great Yarmouth Hub. We have welcomed several new members and are always looking for more. If anyone would like to volunteer to help us support our growing client base or know someone who might, please do contact us for further details. Summer Adventures In early July we took a group to the Lavender Farm in Heacham for a sensory experience and then a day at the seaside in Cromer crabbing on the pier. The Great Yarmouth Hub were again invited to fundraise at the Great Yarmouth Racecourse in August and similar to last year it was a tremendous success raising over £300. New activities and events. As autumn now approaches we will be introducing a new cookery activity that will run monthly in the hub. In addition, we are continuing with our clip and climb sessions at the Marina Centre in Great Yarmouth. In the next few months, we hope to be taking a group to Bressingham Steam and Garden, Fritton Owl Sanctuary, Dis Aviation Museum, Time and Tide Museum in Great Yarmouth, and also the Robin Hood Pantomime at St George's Theatre in Great Yarmouth. Walk Norfolk 2023. We are excited to have been given the opportunity to collaborate with our friends at Pathmakers again this year and in October they will be taking a group from each of our hubs around the sites of Great Yarmouth to experience everything it has to offer. Find more information on our upcoming activities later in this newsletter or by getting in contact. Children, young people and families. The CYPF service organises activities and events to improve confidence and encourage independence. By including the whole family, we empower these families through shared experience and knowledge and build lifelong friendships. Since the last edition, the CYPF department have taken the children and their families to the Norfolk Snow Sports Centre the Snow Tubing, the Great Yarmouth Sea Life Centre and the Hippodrome Circus. These were great fun and was wonderful to see so many people enjoying the sessions. In the coming months we would like to continue to reach more families across the county with the focus of running more events in the Great Yarmouth and Kings Lynn areas. We are starting a new preschool group for Great Yarmouth in the near future as well as bowling groups and a trip to Hunstanton Sea Life Centre. Some of the future events we are running later this year are Snow Tubing at Norfolk Snow Sports Centre Laboratory Media Music Session Christmas Party with Captain Fantastic Sleeping Beauty Christmas Panto at the Norwich Theatre Royal and Christmas Train Ride with a visit from Santa. For more information please email josh at cypf at visionnorfolk.org.uk or call 01603 573 000 extension 505. In order for the CYPF service to expand the activities that we offer across the county, we need volunteers to help support the amazing and fun events. DBS checks need to be completed so volunteers are able to help out when needed. If you or someone you know would like to volunteer, please email 
volunteers at visionnorfolk.org.uk. Equipment news. Technology sessions. We have partnered with RNIB to hold digital technology sessions for local people living with visual impairment. These are one-to-one -one problem solving days to help you with any issues you are having with digital technology and devices. Sessions take place at the Norwich Hub on the 25th September, 30th October, and 27th November. Appointments last 20 minutes each and must be pre-booked with Richard by calling 01603 573 000 extension 322. Tech Tip Be My Eyes app. The Be My Eyes app is a free app available on iOS and Android devices. It connects blind and partially sighted people to sighted volunteers across the globe through a live video connection. You can use your camera-enabled smartphone to request instant video support with basic tasks at any time, day or night. It allows for free, unlimited calls and is anonymous. Common tasks that people request help with include checking expiration dates, distinguishing colors, reading instructions, navigating new surroundings, sorting laundry, and more. You can find the app by searching for Be My Eyes in the Apple or Google Play Store on your smartphone or tablet. Vision Zone 2023 Solutions for Low Vision Join Vision Norfolk Optech UK and blind veterans for a drop-in chat and technology demonstration. Come along to our open days where you can meet your local society, learn about the support we can offer you, and activities you can join. Gain hands-on experience with products and technology with a consultant taking you through the different solutions when it comes to day-to-day -to -day activities. There will be an opportunity to learn more about electronic magnifiers, reading machines, desktops, and much more. Blind veterans will also be there to talk about the guidance they can give in rebuilding lives after sight loss. Monday, 11th September, 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. at the Norwich Bradbury Activity Center, Beckham Place, Edward Street, Norwich, NR3 3DZ. Tuesday, 12th September, 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. at the Great Yarmouth Hub, 12 Hall Key, Great Yarmouth, NR30 1HP. Wednesday, 13th September, 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. at the Kings Lynn Hub, Unit 3, Dundee Court, Hamburg Way, Kings Lynn, PE 32 ND. Activities. Following is the list of activities that are currently available for adults across the county. Please contact cypf at visionnorfolk.org.uk for activities for children and young people. All of our activities are free of charge unless otherwise stated. Please contact your local hub for the latest updates on activities. Norwich and South Norfolk. Unless otherwise stated, please contact Richard at 01603 573 000 extension 322 or email richard.polly at visionnorfolk.org.uk Regular activities Arts and Crafts Norwich Thursdays 10am to 12.30pm Undertake a variety of arts and crafts with support from Helen and the volunteers Contact Mark on 01603 573 000 extension 341 or email mark.smith at visionnorfolk.org.uk Audio Book Clubs Our friendly informal audio book clubs offer a chance to get together and enjoy a chat about a chosen book. The book clubs are free to join and we can supply a memory stick player if you don't have one. Contact Mark on 01603 573 000 extension 341 or email mark.smith 
at visionnorfolk.org.uk. This audio book club, fourth Friday of the month, 2 p.m. to 3.30 p.m. Norwich Audio Book Club, second Monday of the month, 1.30 p.m. to 3 p.m. Botcher, Norwich, first and third Friday of the month, 10 a.m. to 12 p.m. Join us for a session of the competitive precision ball sport botcher, open to all abilities and levels of experience. Bowling, Norwich, second and fourth Friday of the month, 12.15 p.m. to 3.30 p.m. Come and enjoy some friendly competition with 10-pin bowling at Namco Funscape. Transportation available from the Norwich Hub. Regular bowling fee to be paid to Namco Funscape. Creative Writing, Norwich, 3rd Tuesday, 2 p.m. to 3.45 p.m. Join a creative writing group that will give you the opportunity to express yourself through the written word. Contact Mark on 01603 573 000 extension 341 or email mark.smith at visionnorfolk.org.uk Darts Norwich, 1st and 3rd Friday of the month, 1pm to 3pm. Join us for a few friendly games of darts. Volunteers are around to help you position or read the numbers on the board if needed. Macula Society, Norwich, 2nd Friday of the month, 12pm to 1.30pm. This group is organised and run by the Macula Society at the Norwich Hub. Vision Norfolk staff usually give an update on new equipment and activities and there are sometimes guest speakers. Norwich Coffee Morning, last Monday of the month, 10am to 11.30am. Come and enjoy a cup of coffee, a slice of cake and a chat about everything and anything. Photography Group, Norwich, first and third Friday of the month, 1.30pm to 3.30pm. The first meeting in each month is an outdoor photo shoot and the second is an indoor opportunity to review photographs. Some outings may have a cost for refreshments. Contact Mark on 01603 573 000 extension 341 or email mark.smith at visionnorfolk.org.uk Sailing Norwich fortnightly 12.30pm to 5pm Come and enjoy an afternoon of boating on the Norfolk Broads with the Nancy Oldfield Trust. From April to October the group goes out sailing and during winter months they go out on an undercover motor cruiser. Trips cost £17 per person. Contact Mark on 01603 573 000 extension 341 or email mark.smith at visionnorfolk.org.uk Tandem Cycling, Norwich. By appointment, Tandem Cycling allows you to continue to enjoy a good and safe bike ride regardless of your vision loss. Special Events, Guided Walks. We try to organise walks of various lengths when the weather is nice. Please get in contact for more details. Interhub Quiz and Chips, Norwich, the 5th of October, 1.15pm to 4pm. Join the Norwich Hub for an Interhub quiz. Come along and enjoy a fun quiz and some chips too. Costs £5 per person, including chips. Dragon Hall Talk, Norwich, 13th of October, starting at 1pm. Richard Matthew from the Norwich Society will be coming along to the Norwich Hub to give a talk on Norwich's historic Dragon Hall. Felbrig Hall Visit, Felbury, 25th of October, leaving at 11am. Join us on a trip to explore the historic Felbrig Hall. Lunch and an early afternoon introductory talk will be available, as well as an opportunity to explore the house. There is a new guidebook available in Braille for those of you who are Braille readers. Contact Mark on 01603 573 000 extension 341 or Mark dot smith at visionnorfolk.org.uk Walk Norfolk, Great Yarmouth 
30th of October, 10 a.m. to 3 p.m. A facilitator from Pathmakers will be leading a walk in Great Yarmouth. Transportation can be provided from all Vision Norfolk hubs. Mosaics Workshops, Norwich, 2nd and 16th of November. Time to be confirmed. Rebecca Amflip from Dragon Mosaics will be making a very welcome return to the Norwich hub. You'll be able to make a Christmas theme tesserae decoration. You must be able to make both dates to complete your decoration. Garden Eyes Annual Meal, Norwich, November. Further details to be confirmed. During mid to late November, we will be holding our annual Garden Eyes Meal at the Norwich City College. Date, time and cost to be confirmed. Contact Mark on 01603 573 000, extension 341 or email mark.smith at visionnorfolk.org.uk Northern Ballet's Beauty and the Beast, Norwich, 25th of November, 2.30pm to 5pm, must be booked by the 13th of October. Northern Ballet bring their signature sparkle to this timeless love story, choreographed by David Nixon, CBE, and set to a hand-picked score of classic music from the likes of Bizet and Debussy. Tickets cost £49.50. Contact Mark on 01603 573 000, extension 341, or email mark.smith at visionnorfolk.org.uk. Christmas Flower Arranging Session, Norwich, the 11th of December, 10am to 12.30pm. We will be holding a Christmas flower arranging session at the Bradbury Activity Centre. Come and join flower arrangers Hazel and Crystal to make a Christmas wreath and flower swag over a coffee and mince pie. Contact Mark on 01603 573 000 extension 341 or email mark.smith at visionnorfolk.org.uk Christmas at Strangers Hall Museum Norwich, the 13th of December, 10.30am to 12.30pm, must be booked by the 1st of December. The Heritage Group will be visiting Strangers Hall to hear a talk by curator Bethan Holdridge about how Christmas was celebrated back in medieval times. The session includes the opportunity to handle items and visit all the various rooms inside the museum. Contact Mark on 01603 573 000, extension 341 or email mark.smith at visionnorfolk.org.uk Sleeping Beauty Pantomime Norwich, the 28th of December, 2.30pm to 5pm must be booked by the 22nd of September Sleeping Beauty, that famous story A Prince's Kiss, The Saving Glory with opportunity to boo and hiss but will the prince and princess kiss? Tickets cost £40. Contact Mark on 01603 573 000, extension 341, or email mark.smith at visionnorfolk.org.uk. Agatha Christie's And Then There Were None, Norwich, the 1st of February 2024, 2.30pm to 5pm must be booked by the 8th of December. Ten strangers are lured to a solitary mansion off the coast of Devon. When a storm cuts them off from the mainland, the true reason for their presence on the island becomes horribly clear. Directed by Lucy Bailey, this brand new production of the best-selling crime novel of all time will keep you on the edge of your seat. Tickets £38.50. Contact Mark on 01603. 573 000, extension 341 or email mark.smith at visionnorfolk.org.uk West Norfolk Unless otherwise stated, contact Abigail at 01553-660-808 or Kings Lynn Hub at Vision norfolk.org.uk Regular Activities Archery Down a Market First Monday of the Month 
4 p.m. to 6 p.m. Sight loss doesn't need to prevent you from trying new and exciting things. Join one of our archery sessions designed to be accessible for all abilities and skill levels. Art Workshops, Kings Lynn, first Friday of the month, 2 p.m. to 3 p.m. Starting September, we are holding small art workshops with painting, printmaking, collage, and more. Audiobook Clubs. Our friendly, informal audiobook clubs offer a chance to get together and enjoy a chat about a chosen book. The book clubs are free to join, and we can supply a memory stick player if you don't have one. Contact Mark on 01603 573 000 extension 341 or mark.smith at visionnorfolk.org.uk. Durham Audiobook Club, third Wednesday of the month, 10.30 a.m. to 12 p.m. Fakenham Audiobook Club, third Monday of the month, 10.30 a.m. to 12 p.m. Gaywood Audiobook Club, first Thursday of the month, 2 p.m. to 3.30 p.m. Choir, Kings Lynn, fortnightly on Wednesday, 1 p.m. to 3 p.m. Join the Vision Norfolk Choir to improve your mental well-being, meet new people, and most importantly, have fun. Coffee mornings and socials. Come and enjoy a cup of coffee, a slice of cake, and a chat about everything and anything at one of our socials. Emnith Coffee Morning. Third Thursday of the month, 2 p.m. to 4 p.m. Free to attend, but any refreshments must be purchased from the cafe. Downham Market Social, 4th Wednesday of the month, 11 a.m. to 1 p.m. Fakenham Coffee Morning, 4th Tuesday of the month, 10 a.m. to 12 p.m. Free to attend, but any refreshments must be purchased from the cafe. West Norfolk Coffee Morning, Kings Lynn, 1st Wednesday and 3rd Tuesday of the month. 10 a.m. to 12 p.m. Free to attend, but any refreshments must be purchased from the cafe. West Norfolk Men's Group, Kings Lynn, second Monday of the month, 12 p.m. to 2 p.m. Special activities paid for by the group directly. Knitting, Kings Lynn, second Tuesday of the month, 1.30 p.m. to 3.30 p.m. Whether you are a complete beginner who would like to take up knitting or a seasoned knitter, our sessions are a fun and sociable way of getting together with fellow yarn fans. Sit Fit, Down and Market, third Friday of the month, 1.30 p.m. to 3.30 p.m. A seated exercise class suitable for all adults regardless of age, gender, or ability. Tandem Cycling, Kings Lynn, by appointment. Tandem Cycling allows you to continue to enjoy a good and safe bike ride regardless of your vision loss. A sighted guide sits at the front to steer and describe. Special events. Guided walks. We try to organize walks of various lengths when the weather is nice. Please get in contact for more details. Interhub Quiz and Chips. Kings Lynn, 5th October, 2 p.m. to 4 p.m. Join the Kings Lynn Hub for an Interhub Quiz. Come along and enjoy a fun quiz time and some chips too. Five pounds per person, including chips. Walk Norfolk, Great Yarmouth, 30th October, 11 a.m. to 2 p.m. A facilitator from Pathmakers will be leading a walk in Great Yarmouth. Transportation can be provided from all Vision Norfolk hubs. East Norfolk, unless otherwise stated, please contact Catherine at 01493 745 973 or email greatyarmouthhub at visionnorfolk.org.uk Regular activities, audio book clubs. Our friendly and formal audio book clubs offer a chance to get together and enjoy a chat about a chosen book. The book clubs are free to join and we can supply a memory stick player if you don't have one. Contact Mark on 01603 573 000 extension 341 or email mark.smith 
at visionnorfolk.org.uk Great Yarmouth Audio Book Club Last Friday of the month 1.30pm to 3pm Cromer Audio Book Club Third Monday of the month 2pm to 3.30pm Bingo Great Yarmouth Third Tuesday of the month 10am to 12pm Try your luck at one of our bingo sessions with prizes available for winners. Costs £5 per person. Money raised goes towards the bingo prizes and the Hub Christmas Party. The December session will be a week early on the 12th of December. Bowling, Great Yarmouth, last Tuesday of the month, 12pm to 3pm. The Great Yarmouth Hub runs group bowling trips to Wellington Pier. We are asking for a £5 refundable deposit. There will be no session in December. Clip and Climb, Great Yarmouth, monthly on a Thursday, 19th of October, 23rd of November and the 14th of December, 3pm to 4pm. Clip and Climb is made up of a number of unique climbing elements at the indoor climbing gym at the Great Yarmouth Marina Centre. Coffee Mornings and Socials. Come and enjoy a cup of coffee, a slice of cake and a chat about everything and anything at one of our socials. Great Yarmouth Coffee Morning, Wednesdays, 10am to 12pm. Chroma Coffee Morning, last Wednesday of the month, 10am to 1pm. Contact John at 01603 573 000 extension 323 or email john.morland at visionnorfolk.org.uk Cooking and Eating Sessions Great Yarmouth, the second Monday of the month 10am to 12pm We will be starting with pizzas, cakes, biscuits and other food that you can prepare to your individual liking and then staff will cook the food in the air fryer and we can all enjoy together Games Morning Great Yarmouth, Thursdays 10am to 12pm We usually play a variety of dominoes and card games. Weaving Group, Great Yarmouth, Fridays, 10 a.m. to 12 p.m. We use different types of soaked cane to make baskets of all shapes and sizes. Special Events, Guided Walks. We try to organise walks of varying lengths when the weather is nice. Get in contact to find out more. Time and Tide Museum, Great Yarmouth, 2nd of October, tour starting at 11am. This is a touch tour visit to the Bare Bones exhibition at the Time and Tide Museum. The exhibition invites visitors to explore the beauty and secrets of animal skeletons. We are asking for a £5 refundable deposit. Into Hub Quiz and Chips, Great Yarmouth, the 5th of October, 2pm to 4pm. Join the Great Yarmouth Hub for an Inter Hub quiz. Come along and enjoy a fun quiz time and some chips together. Norfolk and Suffolk Aviation Museum, Bungie, the 10th of October. Times to be confirmed. A trip to the Norfolk and Suffolk's Aviation Heritage Centre in Bungie where we will be having a tour and lunch. We are asking for a £5 donation towards the museum for hosting us. Walk Norfolk, Great Yarmouth, 30th of October, 11am to 2pm. A facilitator from Pathmakers will be leading the walk in Great Yarmouth. Transportation can be provided from all Vision Norfolk hubs. Great Yarmouth Hub Service Users Christmas Party, Great Yarmouth, the 19th of December. Times to be confirmed. Time for the Great Yarmouth Service Users to enjoy some festive food and refreshments. Further details to be confirmed. Robin Hood Pantomime, Great Yarmouth, 21st of December, starting at 1pm. We are running another trip to the St George's Theatre Pantomime this year, which is Robin Hood. Seats are priced at £12. Other things. Feedback. Possible activities. From time to time, we receive requests for new activities, and if any readers are interested in the below list of possible activities, please contact Mark on 016035730000 extension 341. We also run a separate leisure activities mailing list with monthly updates on various outings, 
and visits for the gardening, heritage, photography, and theater groups. So let Mark know if you would like to receive this in your chosen format. A monthly meeting for crossword puzzle group in the Holt area. A session at the Norwich Rage Rooms. Horse riding sessions. Lunchtime pub or breakfast group. Tennis sessions. An online virtual bridge club. Glaucoma support group. We have been requested to start a self-help group for those suffering from glaucoma. Glaucoma is the second most common eye condition that results in poor sight after macular degeneration. Is this group something you would be interested in joining? Please let Richard know your thoughts on 016035730000 extension 322. Motorsport with Sporting Car Club of Norfolk. There may be passenger opportunities for keen vision impaired motorsports enthusiasts to be a passenger in a car competing in an auto solo or taking part in a production car trial. Being a passenger is not a passive experience and can involve active participation, particularly in a trial when you will be asked to bounce up and down to help the car get traction on slippery ground. Auto solos are driven in forward gear through a course of cones in accordance with the course map. Most drivers do this in first gear, but it is still quick, exciting, and can involve going sideways. Production car trials are off-road on grassy hillsides, which can get rather muddy by the end of the day. The aim is to gain zero points by driving up a twisty course on the hillside between lines of stakes, each of which are numbered from 12 to zero. If you would like to know more, or if you are interested in taking part, please contact Mark on 016035730 extension 341. Merlin Ultra for sale. Gordon Mills is looking to sell his used Merlin Ultra 24 inch full HD video magnifier with the stand. The cost is 1,500 pounds and it can be delivered. Please contact Gordon for more details by calling 079 Six two seven eight three two nine four, or emailing g a dot m i l l s at outlook dot com. Norwich Fab Club. The Norwich Fab Club is a free local community group open to people with disabilities. They meet on Mondays from seven p.m. until eight thirty p.m. at Helsden Community Center. Woodview Road, NR6 5QB, to socialize and create music. They have a number of members with sight loss and would welcome anyone else who would like to come along. For more information, contact Martin Fuller by calling 01603 or emailing a n n e and martin fuller at gmail.com contact information for further information on how we can support you and how you can get involved website visionnorfolk.org.uk telephone 01603 0 Email office at visionnorfolk.org.uk Our hubs can be found at Norwich, Bradbury Activity Centre, Beckham Place, Edward Street, Norwich, NR3 3DZ Telephone 01603 0 Email office at visionnorfolk.org.uk Kings Lynn, Unit 3, Dundee Court, Hamburg Way, Kings Lynn, PE 30 2 N D. Telephone 01553 660 808. Email Kings Lynn Hub at visionnorfolk.org.uk. Great Yarmouth, 12 Hall Key. Great Yarmouth, NR30, 
one HP telephone O one four nine three seven four five nine seven three email Great Yarmouth Hub at visionnorfolk dot org dot UK registered charity number two zero seven zero six zero